Glad that you can join us. Yeah, um, to be here. Today, me, Troy, I'm Travis Nunley, and this is Dr. Troy Nunley with the Tech Twins. Um, and we're going to be talking about my crazy AI system that we use to automate our agency and take it to the next level. Trust me, this would be a game changing presentation that you will use for the lifetime of your business. It is literally the future of business. And so if you stay to the end, you'll learn exactly how I generated $5,225 in two hours using custom, what we call custom AI and AI systems. All right, so let's talk a little bit briefly um, about how we got started and did this. So this, I'm Troy, I'm Travis, <laughs> and this is Dr. Troy Nunley. Sometimes I even get myself messed up. Um, we're the Tech Twins, and uh, we started building agencies back in 2009. Uh, we've been running agencies for a very long time. Uh, we've been building software uh, we run a software agency but we ran you know and worked with marketing agencies consulting agencies coaches and so forth and we've been building and launching software for years now uh, here's a couple of our clients um, we're not going to get too much into what we do because we're here really to help you um, but we worked with AT&T, McKesson, Home Depot, uh, Lessis, Toyota, 3M, Auto Nation Department of Defense. I mean, we've been doing it and we've been behind the scenes with some of the greatest companies and great founders, um, as well as uh, some of the great clients over the years. Um, here's one of our, uh, you know, clients. Um, they ended up selling their company to Amazon. And so we're super excited, super excited to work with that company. Um, this company was an AI company and we're in the business of AI. So, you know, this is one of our first start companies that we started working in AI. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. So here's what happened. All right, so we were working last year and we were working our business, but and it was making money, uh, but it was very tired, tiresome and, and time consuming. Um, we were like, working long hours, 16 hour days, often too busy to get the real growth activities done. Have you ever been so busy doing operations, implementing for clients and trying to get results that you forgot about your own business and and couldn't grow and scale that business. So that's essentially what happened to us. And so we started seeing as we started, our team started getting more overwhelmed that there was inconsistencies in delivering results. As the team started to have more work piled on their plate, they couldn't give the undivided attention to the client, which caused issues in our deliverables. It started to, to be quite frank, cause our quality to start to drop. And so um, we wanted to think through some ways to solve this problem. Also, comp competition, man. Competition was driving prices down. People was going over to India. They were going over to Asia. They were going over to, you know, uh, Africa and started getting basically a quarter of the cost because, you know, for those countries, you know, their dollar bill may be less cost or their dollar bill may have less value. And so there was getting you know, Philippine developers for $3 an hour. And we was trying to figure out how can we compete? And so what happened was since a lot of companies started moving over overseas, companies wanted a lot more for a lot less. They wanted to have more developers, more quality work, more communication, but they wasn't willing to pay for it. I mean, they was looking for champagne on a beer budget. And so we were, I was sitting with Troy trying to, I, figure out, man, what does the future of business look like? What what can we do to better optimize our systems to make um, our profit margins not shrink? And the, what can we do to better position our company? And so we started to think through AI. Um, and this was actually before the drop of ChatGPT. This was, you know, months and years before that. And we started thinking through, but a AI now started to speed up the process to get to some real quality results. And so what I want to do today is think through how to implement AI to help you grow your company and help grow the companies of your clients. And so to give you a background, we tried these, these techniques that we're going to talk about today. We call them AI systems. And we've been, uh, we actually been doing this for for big enterprise for years, years. And when we tried this for one of our clients, McKesson, uh, we saw that they grew their company uh, by just identifying one simple process. They grew their company and revealed an additional $1.2 million in revenue by automating 
and using our AI systems um, by automating a simple process. Okay, so we're looking to try to think through what does that look like for you and how do we execute this in your company? So to implement AI systems and what that means is that we use AI systems for our portfolio and for small and medium clients, but we were using it for enterprise, but now dropped, um, got it, the, you know, started working it with it with, with your type of companies, uh, small, medium sized company. We wanted to slay Goliath. We wanted to be, help the Davids out there to slay the Goliaths. So you may ask a question, what is an AI system? What is an AI system? So AI system is a team of helpful, smart, artificial intelligent assistants. We call them AI agents that help you accomplish tasks and objectives. You give it a goal, it tries to hit that goal. You give it a set of tasks, it tries to help your team members do better while creating that task. Essentially, this is a system that will help your team become superheroes. So think of this like Jarvis, okay? Um, Jarvis is an Iron Man. He's an AI system a system that helps Jarvis, uh, excuse me, that helps Iron Man becomes a superhero, right? He's behind the scenes helping Iron Man create the Iron Man suit, help him navigate complex obstacles, helping him defeat the enemy. And so he helps, and he's a critical part of Iron Man being Iron Man. It's this AI system that helps the genius accomplish much more. If you remember Iron Man, he created the whole, Iron Man created the whole Iron Man suit by simply himself, really. Um, him and Jarvis created the Mach 2, which is the more refined version of the Iron Man suit. So we want to do that for your business. We want to create assistants, AI assistants that can help you and your team become superheroes to give your team really superpowers. Okay. So let's talk about who's doing this currently in this space. Okay. So here's a couple of, uh, you know, what, what people would call influencers. They have hundreds of thousands, if not millions of subscribers. And they talk about what they're doing in the business space. So we have the guy on the left, which is uh, Pace Morby. They just announced that, that they are launching AI to help with lead generation. Okay, so he has a portfolio of 25 million plus in a real estate. We've seen this in a, the service base and, and, and coaching um, clients. So this guy is Alex Hermosi. He, you know, says that he has $100 million plus in, in annual revenue for his companies. He tasked his team to replace themselves using AI. That's crazy. All right, so then we also have here Cody Sanchez. She's in a boring business space. Um, she helps buy and sell boring businesses like laundry mats and so forth. And she also tasked her team to help streamline processes using AI. But this is not just for, you know, this is a worldwide phenomenon. Okay, you've seen people like Elon Musk and the CEO of Microsoft tell you how much AI is gonna impact the future. And so you have to start thinking through your business um, because it's critical, it's critical that you start thinking through what the strategies are, how you're going to implement that business. Um, let's talk through some statistics real quick. 85 million jobs worldwide could potentially be replaced by AI. That's crazy. 85 million jobs. And this is not 10 years from now. This is by 2025. So this is two years, potentially 85 million jobs could be impacted. The so second Robots, they're saying that robots will re replace 30% of the human ro on workforce by 2030. And this is, this is reputable research firms telling you this. McKinsey, the World Economic Forum, Forrester all said that 16% of American jobs by 2025. McKinsey also said 375 million people will have to switch careers by 2030. So think about that. Whatever you're doing now, your company... And we, we, we're talking about this in the career, so your employees, but the reason why this will happen for your employees, because companies are already thinking through what AI looks for their company, right? These are the stats that kind of give me nightmares. What's going to happen to our workforce? What's going to happen to the economic viability of our countries or country, depending on where you, where you are, okay? Um, but then where there is pain, there is gain. Where there's a challenge, there's an opportunity. So AI, what 
how we look at AI is one of the biggest opportunities in our lifetime. This is internet, you know, the, when the internet came out, it's the, that level of opportunity. And so you need to start thinking through how are you going to utilize and take advantage of it. Let's talk through some stats here. 72% of execs believe that AI would be the most significant business advantage of the future. Not sales, not marketing, not operations, but implementing AI to help with all of that. And so you, we're trying to figure out how to do that effectively for companies worldwide. 15% of enterprises uses AI currently and 31% of them say that it's on their agenda for the next 12 months. All right. Also, and I'm gonna skip to the bottom here. Like, well, actually this nowadays one is a pretty, pretty impactful. 77% are using AI. The current market is 136 billion but it's looked to be one, two trillion within the next eight or so years. That is like a 10,000 time increase in AI. That is crazy, right? This is a market that's growing faster than any other market in the history of markets, okay? And lastly, 36% of executives say that their primary goal for incorporating AI is to optimize internal business operations. So, that is exactly what we do and what we've built. We built an AI to optimize internal business operations. So I know what you're asking. How do you scale your company with AI? Okay. So I'm going to tell you how I did mine. And we're going to just give you everything that we've done in order to scale this company. It's a real simple process. So once you understand the business of business, it becomes real easy to automate. Okay, so the key to automation is one key concept, and that is know your systems that generate customers and know the systems that deliver value. All right, and then once you know those systems, you can figure out how to automate those systems. So in our business, we call this the Get Happy Customers System. And so what the Get Happy Customer System is, is first, we focus on get customers, and then the second part of that system is you make the customers happy. The way we do that is we focus on two main systems, customer acquisition and value delivery. Customer acquisition is the system it takes to get a person to a sale. This is your ads. This is your content going out. This is salespeople talking to call, booking appointments, setters, whatever it is to get a person from the first time they see your message to when they close the deal. That's what we call get customers, the get customer, customer acquisition system. Once that deal is closed, you have to deliver on the value in which you promised. Okay. So you promised the value of some type of offer then now you got to actually deliver that value. And that's what we call our value delivery systems. And so what we've done is we took those systems and we broke those systems up into our business and try to figure out what are the systems for our company. And so for us, we broke it out into subsystems. Um, this is the way we generate an audience. This is how people, how we get more people eyeballs on a message. Are you running ads? Are you doing social? Are you, uh, doing SEO, search engine optimization, and, and trying to get people to search you in Google. What does your audience generation looks like, system to look like? Next, how do we get those people who've seen our message, raise their hand, and basically say, I'm interested? We call this the lead generation system. This is how we collect the lead and how we determine if a person's interested. For us, we use landing pages um, you know, to capture a lead offer something for free on a topic and see if we can capture a lead. Next, once we capture that lead, we nurture that lead to book an appointment or get them to the next action. That could be book appointment or buy a trip, tripwire, smaller offer. We're just trying to get that lead over to the next step. What does that system look like for your company? Is that automated email sequence? Is that automated test message system? Is that sales people or you know business development reps calling up your clients and trying to get them over to a booked appointment what does that look like for your system and then lastly there is some type of sales conversion this is how you take a lead and convert them over into a sale all right so this is for us 
a salesperson talking to that lead, having a conversation, figuring out if there's a good fit, identifying the need, and then offering them the opportunity to work together. All right. So we use this four step system for customer acquisitions. But then there's a system for value delivery. Okay. And how we deliver values um, for, you know, how do we get the client over to get the result and get the transformation? So for us, our focus is always to focus first and automate over time. You don't want to try to automate your whole business right now. You want to take simple tasks that you're that's just causing the most pain in your company and automate those first. We go through a three step way of of uh, of automating. This is kind of our focus. We found one avatar in the growing market. We didn't find one offer that, you know, and tweak our offer so people want what we're trying to sell. And then we try to figure out a customer acquisition system to get that avatar to purchase that offer and do that in a way that an avatar buys predictably over time. Okay. We call this the eyeball to the sale. All right. So you want to start thinking through that for your company. Um, we're going to talk through like how we automated our customer acquisition system moving forward. Um, and so, you know, we're not going to go into the fulfillment automation right now, just because, you know, once you jump on a call, we can identify some of the fulfillment opportunities. I'm just trying to show you today how we went, how do we, how do we grow and scale our company currently using, you know, some of the things that we built. So for the sake of our example, we do, we're doing what we call a free value to appointment and paid ad system. And so what this means is this is the exact system that we use and a lot of people in the space use. I'm um, sorry if it's cut off on your, on your screen, but we use a lot of people in the space use this system. They simply ask a prospect to join their email list by giving something free. It could be a free guide, a free giveaway, lead manic, free training, free piece of small piece of software. It could be free ebook give something away for free that's of value and then once they get collect that lead then a salesperson or a series of emails go out to try to book an appointment with that person and then once they book that appointment they go to the sales person and then the person closes we call this our free value to appointment with paid ad system okay so we're not just the only ones doing this. This, this like I said, it's done before. I mean, there's John Pimperthy. He's doing it for, you know, he did it to generate $2.5 million in his company. Alice Heck, he, you know, built a $25 million company. Uh, clients on demand, they, they've uh, sold over $100,000, $100 million um, dollars in, in their company. So we're going to try to do, we're doing the same. And then, but what we do is we implement AI to build all this for you in a relatively short period of time. What usually takes you six weeks, we do we can do it in like, you know, five days. All right, so here's how this system works. And I'm giving you game on like the internal system that we using, um, but a lot of people are really using this across the industry. So first step is the audience generation. This is eyeballs uh, on your message. How do you get people to see your message well for our system we use what they call an audience generation campaign and that's simply targeting a market with a ad um, in this case we use the youtube ad next and those youtube ads look like this it's like you just come up with different advertisements now like i said we're going to show you how to automate all this for you the ad creation copy uh posting it to the ad site monitoring and, and, and alerting you when you know, and things like that. So we're going to go deeper into that. The next step in our system was lead gener is lead generation. Lead generation is getting that person who clicked on that ad to a landing page and giving them something free for it. In, in, in exchange, you give them, they give you your, their email address. Okay. This is an example of some landing pages. Like I said, what's unique about our system is that a lot of people use click funnels. A lot of people use Wix, WordPress. What we're doing is we're using AI to build these landing pages for you. 
The next one is value delivery system. Um, this is, I said value delivery, I'm sorry, need nurturing system. The lead nurturing system is how you nurture and give them information, valuable information over time to get them to move to the next step, whether that's buy a product or to jump on an appointment. So for us, we just use a series of emails, follow-ups, that's actually sends to the client and allows them to book the call. And then lastly, we have our sales conversion. Sales conversion is how do we, now that a person has decided to book that call, how do we close the deal? How do we get them to, a, to become a client? Okay, so we go through and after they book the call, uh, you know, book a calendar, thank you video, we do a consultation meeting and that's how our sales process. All right, so essentially what we're doing here is we are building out a sales a, a system. We're looking at every single deliverable in our company. And then we documented every single deliverable, okay? So we identify areas in our business where our business can identify, uh, can use AI to scale the company, okay? So that humans can be more visionaries around the deliverable. AI can do a lot of the grunt work and the human can help the AI become a stronger, get to help the AI create a deliverable um, that's stronger and stronger. All right, so here's an example of some things, some ways AI can help. We looked at all our tasks. Identify target audience, identify targeting on YouTube, craft the YouTube ad script, edit YouTube ads, build landing page. These are all the tasks in order to accomplish and build this customer acquisition system. We first wrote down and identify all of them. All right, and then after we identify all of them, we identify which ones can be turned into AI. So we turn that list into a library, what we call AI SOPs. SOPs stand for Standard Operating Procedures. This is a list of tasks on how to get and finish those deliverables. And so what that means is we're allowing AI to help us in the creation and, and execution and finishing and completion of those tasks. And so our AI system is what we call Trey. All right, so Trey is an AI designed uh, to create deliverables and seamlessly integrate soft into software, our business system software, okay? Let me show you an example. Let me show you what this looks like. Um, so let me just go down here. All right, so I'm going to jump into an example of, of Trey, and I'm just bringing Trey over to above the PowerPoint slide so you guys can see it. All right, so what we did was we're basically looking at ways um, and, and just kind of showing you this we're looking at ways that we can integrate all of the ai tools into one comprehensive ai system that can help us build companies we want our dream and i'm just be quite frank is that we can give an objective hey build me a youtube marketing campaign that's going to give away a free guide on how to grow your company using ai so we give it an objective like that right and then from that objective then it's gonna use all of the AI tools in a space in order to try to accomplish that objective. And so for Trey, we documented, and I'm just kind of show you this, we documented all of the tasks in order to get the uh get the you know this this free value to appointment funnel built. Um, we have to identify target markets, identify, you know, your YouTube ad uh, um, targeting because we're going to identify target, but then we're going to post on YouTube, uh, create your messaging, uh, create your offer. Then we splinter your offer into a free giveaway. Uh, create your ad script, ed, uh, you know, create an editor notes to send over to the editing team to edit the video. Um, you know, if you're doing any production, you know, production film tasks to go over to the production team to help you film the video. Uh, we can send to the teleprompter automatically that's in our office. So we're in a, like right now we're in a studio office and we have AI sending the script to a teleprompter. 
we have AI editing the videos. And so we're you you're utilizing a suite of tools. We call them the friends of Trey that Trey simply quarterbacks the information from tool to tool and it gets the deliverables done as close to autopilot as possible that we can get it. Okay. Everything's not going to be perfectly automated at this point. We're seeing the infancy of AI, um, but as close to automated as we can get it. Uh, we have AI generation tools for creating headlines, but also building landing pages. Okay. So this one creates a whole entire funnel for, for your company. Um, and so forth. And so what we did was we created a suite of AI automations. We documented every single process in our company, every single task in our company. And then we've created almost like an SOP. And so AI would, with the help of humans will go in and start to knock down all the tasks for your company. Game changing. Imagine how much time is spent going through and building out a whole entire customer acquisition system for six weeks, depending on how, you know, how much time you're doing. We can do that in a day. We usually took you six weeks. Okay. Normal time is usually not a day. You got to grind to get through a day. You, it may take you, you know, three to five days to get this done using AI because you got to do a lot of right now what we call editing. Um, but shh, this is game changing. It literally saves you hundreds if not thousands of time dollars and time okay so we are using ai to optimize internal business operations and so let me show you and tell you exactly and kind of going through this process how we made five thousand two hundred and twenty five dollars in two hours and so let me give you the backstory in our company the first deliverable that we always give our clients is what we call a discovery a discovery is a 90 day blueprint in order to get to get you to the result that we intend to get in you. So it's a lot of times it's customized depending on the client. Um, we have a system of how we get there, but then we'll customize it based on that company's, you know, objectives, that company's goals. Um, so we had these 90 day plans and we was charging quite a bit of money. I mean, $5,000 to $20,000 or these 90 day plans for enterprise. And so we had a client who came to us and they wanted to create a, what we call a tech blueprint, which is a 90 day plan to build out. Like we run a software agency, so 90 day plan to build out their software project. And so we thought this through, we usually take two weeks to do that. I usually put you down on a two week schedule, business analysts would look at your, your company and start to draft up a document. Well, by implementing AI, what well, took us two weeks to create these discovery documents and tech blueprints only took us two hours. It took us about 15 minutes to create a 30 page document. That's a 90 day plan that's catered to our company. So we, tra we trained the AI to be able to give the answer based on what our business analyst team would give. We did it in about 15 minutes. And then the rest of the time, the hour and 45 minutes that was left, we just had our business analyst review that document. So what usually took, and we would have had to pay a business analyst thousands of dollars to do. We only paid them for two hours at a time. And then AI did the rest. Okay. And so what we did and kind of just showing you uh, an example of this, we did this, what they call roadmap builder, and then we can paste in a project. So for example, AI for, or, or create a project, AI for video editing that takes MP4s um, and cuts the silences and do jump cuts all using, you know, basically use AI for video editing, right? And then we send it to our AI and our AI is going to start to have a conversation with you. It's not just, you just, you don't have to just tell it what to do. It's going to ask you what to give it in order to accomplish these ro roadmap builders. Okay. And so from there, um, it takes a second for our AI to think through, um, but it's thinking through, okay, what's the project description? What's the, you know, uh, what's the format that I'm trained in order to craft this document? Uh, what's the, you know, you know, for us, we have what we call function requirements is what, what are we going to build? And it starts the process to build, um, that document. 
And so just this draft alone would have taken us, you know, an hour or so to create. Um, this draft already has been out in the AI. Now I can simply answer the questions the AI is asking me, and it's going to refine tuning within 15 minutes. I can click one button, and then from this button, it sends it to a Google Doc already pre-integrated that I can send to the client. Okay, so this is game changing. What well, we literally took us two weeks. We're now doing the two hours. All right. So here's what what trade. Here's what AI does in the traditional sense. Um, it creates. Oh, oh so kind of give you background before I t jump into that. The client said that this was the best roadmap they ever seen. We built them five thousand two hundred twenty five dollars to do this. Took us two hours. And the result was that the client said that this is the best roadmap that you ever seen. Isn't that powerful? The key here to building AI systems is utilizing AI and humans together, working harmon you know, harmoniously. Is that a word, Troy? Working together as one um, to, in order to build out the best deliverable possible and do it at a fraction of time, which more with more value to your customers. Okay. So we did the same system and our goal is now that we've done this and, and tested it and building these out for, you know, um, $5,000 to $10,000 for every two to four hours. Our goal is to crank out four of these blueprints per day. So that'll be $20,000 per day added to our, our revenue twenty thousand dollars per day okay now we're we're not us you know getting we're not just getting started we've been in business for a while as you know twenty thousand dollars per day is an additional i don't know five million plus i'm being conservative here with five million is probably closer to six six point two or six point three million dollars in additional revenue and now everybody's not this is not possible for everybody um but you know like i said these are our results and what we're trying to do and our, what we're trying to accomplish this this upcoming year so the question is how do we get the quality of ai like i mentioned before we pair the ai with team to maximize the creativity and also we pair ai with the team member in order to give it the personal touch all right and so that gives that it gives it a human element to the AI to make it more empathetic, um, to make it more catered to the human psychology. All right, so like I said, this is the most disruptive tech in our lifetime. And this AI, AI systems will disrupt lead generation, social media, coaching businesses, SEO, ad agencies, business development reps, modeling agencies, we've seen AI companies start to create AI models that look like human beings, but there is a person that doesn't exist, but it's a beautiful AI model that can model clothing for, for other companies. We've seen it disrupt the video editing space, software development. This AI is going to touch any industry, especially in the digital industry. So these are coaches, these are consultants, these are agencies, these are authors, anything that's content as well as digital. This is software. Um, these are lawyers. It, it, it goes across the board. And so we don't want you to get ahead of that. And so what we want to offer you uh, today is just a simple conversation. All right. We want to offer you for free the opportunity to jump on a call with us. Um, to be honest with you, you know, we want to give people free the first access to get early access to Trey. We want to look at your business processes. We want to document, okay, what are you doing in your business? And then is there an opportunity that we can build an automation that can streamline that business and make your business more scalable, make your business more profitable, and make your business scale to the next level? And we're here to do that. Okay, so if you're in, interested in unlocking the profit for your business, join our Get Early Access list. That's the first link that you see below us. And then once you join our Get Early Access list, um, when you when we're ready, we will reach out to you. So be ready when you see that reach out, because if you if you don't reply to the person who reaches out to you, they're ready to implement your business in the tray. Then 
uh you will miss that spot you will miss it and then you'll end up getting put to the end of the queue and so what we want to do is we want to help help you get there but we can't help everyone and so we're looking for our first uh 10 people that we can onboard to automate their companies um and so sign up for that get early access list below this below this page and so that we can start the process of taking a look at your company and seeing if you are a good fit to be automated with AI. So sign up right now um, and we'll see you, we'll see you, see you on a call.